It's worth noting that this is a sketch. It's not a presentation drawing, and that's why I'm starting with a hand-drawn circle rather than using a pair of compasses or a circle template. I'm starting with the lightest grey marker pen in a range of 10 tones, each a little darker than the previous one. Alongside my sphere, I'm using the same pens to help me to visualise the range of tones I'll use to build the sphere. Having started with the lightest, I'm then going slightly darker with the next pen, but I'm stopping short of where I went to with the first, so that a graduation of tone begins to become apparent. I'm doing the same with the next tones. I want my sketch to be quick, I want it to be free of the constraints of accuracy, and I want it to be representational. By that, I mean that I want it to simply represent a sphere, rather than to look like a photograph of one. The reason for this is that I want my sketching to quickly convey my thoughts to a client. I don't need the client to be impressed by my drawing skills, I need them to understand my ideas. Here I'm going back to a light tone pen, and I'm going diagonally over the darker area. This starts to blend the ink from the other pens together, making the marks a little less obvious. And now I'm going back to where I left off with the darker pens. I'm using a slightly darker tone each time to represent the area of the sphere which is further away from the light source. I don't want to worry too much about blending my lines, and if I start to focus too much upon accuracy, I will lose my relaxed, free-flowing approach, I'll slow right down, I'll limit my creativity and hinder my ability to design. I keep reminding myself that my sketch is a representation of a sphere, and it's not supposed to be a photorealistic presentation drawing. I'm using the fine end of the pen to finish off any areas which have noticeable issues. I'm not trying to make my sketch look more accurate, but I do want to take a moment or two to adjust any areas which draw attention away from this simply representing a sphere. Here I'm improving the graduation of tone across the fine margin above the highlight. I hope this video has been helpful, please hit like if it has, there will be lots more on the way so please subscribe and hit the notifications tab to be kept up to speed. To watch my progress and to see my other pursuits you can follow me on Instagram at Product Designer Maker. Thanks for watching.